Welcome to a brand new episode of Moto Moments. This one's packed with heart-pounding action and adrenaline-fueled excitement. Trust me, you won't want to miss a second. So stick around until the end and enjoy the ride. This biker had no idea his ride would lead him straight into a heated road rage showdown between a drunk guy and a taxi driver. <laughs> Hocam telefonum burada. Arabaya bindiniz gitsiniz diyorum bana burada kaydettiler vurdular bana vurdular. Müşteri misin sen? Oradakiler bana vuruyorlar. What was meant to be a simple cruise quickly turned into front row seats for a verbal clash. One simple rule. If you can't exit an intersection, don't enter it. From hay spills to near collisions, this ride had it all. What? I said you're gonna get killed on that thing, how you drive it. How was I driving it? Like this. I was warming out my tires. It helps. Yeah, yeah. You pulled out in front of me with all that crappy hay, bro. Yeah, I know. I hear you. You're not you're even gonna, gonna, gonna apologize? No, you're gonna get killed. Bro, what? I didn't You're stupid. Two on three, please. Ten on three? Two on three. Two. Uh, two on three. Yeah. But I had two brothers and, and a lot of best friends get killed on motorcycles, okay? I just want you to be careful. I see I live on Jackson Street and I see you going up and down on there all the time going mm -hmm. down the street. I'm not trying to I'm just trying to you know, maybe give you some lies. I know. Word. You know what I mean? Yeah. I've been in this town, I have three kids, three sons that are police officers. Alright? I could easily take your plate and I have I have friends. I'm not doing it. I'm not trying. I'm just trying to. Well, I didn't do anything illegal. Okay. But you can't be going like this down the street. I'm just trying to say, be, be more careful and think about what I'm being doing. careful. I, mean, I don't appreciate it when someone pulls out in front of me and the hay's well, coming well, out on me. Well, hey, you went on the other side of me. The hay wasn't going on there. But so, hey, I'm just telling you. And then you got smart with me in there. How old are you? Does you? that matter? Yeah, it does. All you right, need to grow well, up. I, I need to grow up. You're like 50 talking to a kid I'm like this. Than that, buddy. And I'm going to tell All you something. Right. I got three boys that never got smart with anybody. I'm not going right. to be smart. I'm just telling you to be careful on that thing. I will be careful. All right. A driver, clearly distracted, nearly took out the biker. But thankfully, no one was hurt. It's a reminder that accidents can happen even without bad intentions. Oh la vache, je vous ai pas vu du tout. Vous avez mal Non, non, tout va bien, vous inquiétez pas, mais. Vous avez mal, vous Biker started recording after the main reason of this road rage happened, which is cutting off and nearly sideswiping Biker from the driver's side.
this biker wasn't too happy with the driver's maneuver. People who were passing by made sure to check on the biker. Is that why you have the GoPro? Because of pricks like that. Yeah. I ride with my high beams on. How the f can't you see that? Good reaction. Thanks. Yeah. Mind if I cut a front seat? Yeah. And then there's the classic case of someone backing into the road without looking, putting the biker in danger. When called out, the driver got defensive showing how quickly things can escalate. Are you really gonna back out? Are you really gonna back out onto the road? That's really unsafe, man. No, but I'm just saying it's really unsafe. All right, well, think of others and not just yourself, please. Not every biker is part of the reckless crowd, but one, innocent rider, found himself treated like a criminal from the start. The police jumped to conclusions, proving you should never judge a book by its cover. Just because you're on a bike, doesn't mean you're in the same crew. I'm not Look, doing anything, right man. Now. I'm not doing, I'm, I'm street legal, right man. Shut I'm not doing anything, I'm street What's legal. What the f is everybody doing? I, I ride the trails, man. Uh, yeah. I'm recording this too. I'm not doing I'm street legal. I got Everything's up to date. I'm not on that bull, man. What is all this? I don't know. Right. Stop. Pull it over right now. Pull it over. I ride trails. I, I don't ride with you kids, man. You got a plane? Yeah, I'm 100%. Yeah, man. And all that. I don't do all that. Doesn't matter. You see everybody riding all over the place? What's I, the name of this group? I don't know, man. I don't ride. I'm not on that dirt bag, man. I'm a hundred, look. Are you I, the fall look, guy that just stops so that we talk to you? I don't do that, man. Shit. I'm telling you. You want my information? Every, right. er, everything's up to date. Right. I'm not on that bull. Right. I, huh? And surely. Just I'll, go home. Don't be a part of this. Nah, man. Just go home. All right. Be smart. Don't, don't I don't, I don't associate with these yeah, kids. Just leave. You're I ride trails. Jesus Christ. What the I know, man. I ride the trails. I don't associate with this kid, so I can see how they can confuse me, but I got a plate on there. That's I'm fine. street legal, you know? What the f***? Right, don't give a f you, so we'll I got right. pissed, though, because it's not yeah, the first time. Know. All the time I get pulled over. God damn. People like making drama where drama is nowhere to be seen.
Was ist geschissen so noch einer? <lacht> Der Volltrottel am Seinbruch, Alter. Wo kommt der her? Wo war kein? Der ist noch voll fett, glaube ich. Halt die Goschen, du Volltrottel, Alter. Ich glaube, der bringt mich jetzt um. Biker knew he was at fault 100%. Passersby stepped in to check on the rider, ensuring everything was okay. Sometimes, drivers make mistakes, like that van driver who skipped using his blinker for a risky U-turn. A group of three-wheeler riders got busted by the police earning themselves hefty tickets and multiple charges. Look over here. Nothing, like no warning or anything no, for us? No, Like we obviously didn't know that we weren't allowed to be here. Well, this, you know what? You have to learn this stuff before you jump mm -hmm. on somebody's property or a trail or whatever. Mm -hmm. You can't just use something I, I was without, under the impression okay? that this was allowed, actually. That's why we're here. Wow. You need to verify stuff, man. What can I say? Yeah, we looked it up online and they were telling us that they wanted to make this a Trans-Canada Trail for everyone. For snowmobiles, maybe. Not, not for, they don't groom these. Those destroy snowmobile trails. No, they don't. These actually... Okay, so, I'm not going to argue with you, so please I know, but stop. just because of the three wheels, they actually end up grooming the trails more than they do. Honda? That's not the way it's done. Yeah, but, uh, all of them are Honda. <laughs> do, you guys all, do you guys all own your own? Yeah. 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 I have my paperwork, but oh. I... I don't have it in my name, but I have the ownership when I bought it from the gentleman. Do you have it here though? No, I have it in my safe at home. <laughs> you, you could check all the VINs if you want and find out. Yeah. Like they're, we, no, no, no. I'm going to believe you. If you say you own them, I'm going to believe you. But the problem is you don't have your stuff with you. Like. Yeah. How far do you have to go? I just got to go home. My house is down the road from here. That's why we're okay, used to it. How far is that? Like, the, do you have, how many roads do you have to cross? One. You got to go straight and then right. Road. That's it. So then we're at my road, house. Yeah, just have to it's right yeah, on, the, on yeah. the curb, right? Yeah. 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 So the uh, this became part of the MSV, so the uh, snowmobile vehicle. Snowmobile, yeah. So that's uh, all new to me right now, and I was. Well, you got to keep yourself updated, buddy. If somebody doesn't ride I, for ten years, and all of a sudden they get on and they think they're just going to do what they did ten years ago, I, that's all. I'm, I'm completely, I'm okay, completely good. aware of that, but it's hard for people to get all the information sometimes. Well, right? you got to check it out before you start riding. You can't just jump on and ride because if you do, you're riding at your own risk. Well, you know what I'm, It's a bad day. For I understand. You. I don't want to upset you. Okay. I understand. Okay. I'm just trying to explain from our point of view, right? Like I, I totally get what you guys. We were did. trying our best to not go bother other people and get off the, you know, like get away from the city and stuff, and then we still get in trouble. Mm, like it's, it's, it's difficult, but... they learned a tough lesson, it could have been worse. Care of you guys, or, or went faster since it's only one. All right, so they're all charges. Uh, the only one that's not in there, I'm not gonna charge you for it, is the driver's license. You need a driver's license, you don't have it. Yeah. Um, so, I'm just 
not finding it in the computer and I don't want to spend more time because my hands are getting frozen. Cool, cool, so you're lucky for that one. Thank you for that. But saying that, all the charges, it's going to come to a pretty big amount. I figured. But, yeah, but there's stuff that you can do, okay? So I don't know if you do have insurance. My feeling is you don't. You don't. Okay? You don't have registration. You don't have a number plate. So you don't have any of that stuff. So it's going to be a little bit harder. But what they normally do is you ask for a first attendance meeting to the, uh, the provincial crown. Okay. You go and talk to the provincial crown and say, hey, if you can bring the documents and you have them, then normally they avoid, we'll give you a they avoid the charges. Okay. In your case, I have no clue what they can do. I'm sure they can reduce the amount. You can ask for a lesser fine. But other than that, I, I don't know what they're going to do. Yeah, I'm, I'm screwed. <laughs> but I, no, I, I like, it's worth the try. I mean, no, yeah, if, for sure. If you go and talk with them, um, I don't know if your plan is to insure it or whatever. But no, eventually, yeah, it was my plan. Yeah, but I'm, just, I'm, a, I'm a bit defined right now. Though. All right, so so this one is for no plates. 110. That's 110. They're yeah. mostly the trespass for being on the snowmobile trail. That's 65. Uh, the no insurance is the biggest one. That's 325. 325. You need insurance. Okay. Right. So if we call and get insurance, then sometimes it could be like the same. Well, when you something. already have the insurance, mm -hmm. normally you go to the courthouse. Like I said, you ask for a first attendance meeting. Yeah. You talk to the crown. Hey, you know, like I, I forgot my my driver, uh, not my driver's license, my insurance, insurance. paper and all that. Yeah. A lot of the time, there's uh, as long as you have insurance, they'll look at it and say, oh, okay, you didn't have it void the ticket that that's the end of it like insurance for your vehicle no for the machine for the, for for the, the machine, machine i guess yeah. so normally it's the same insurance whichever company yeah. you're dealing with did you, you they just add it to your insurance slip and then when you give the insurance paper we'll we'll look at the bottom and it's going to say honda whatever, whatever yeah. yeah the model on it and it just says that it's also insured on your policy but probably. makes sense so with crown land and stuff are you allowed to go on no crown, crown land it's uh, you public. have to be it's public yeah yeah. So Private property is you owning a farm or a land and yeah, now we have you're a cottage going on your Chicago land. And stuff too, so like, that's I guess the only spot that we'd be allowed. There you go. At yeah. your cottage, that's like we have no jurisdiction on your property yeah, unless course. it's criminal offense. Then you can you can do pretty much whatever you want with your machine. Okay. Alright, so the other one is uh, insurance. I just That was 325 you said? 325. And the last one is the uh, permit for the machine the machine which you don't have because you don't have the number plate so that one is 110 also all right all right uh, the other one i could have given you is not to have a the trail pass but obviously it's not a snow machine the trail pass is actually more expensive than the trespass oh really yeah well wow, okay so the trespass is uh 65 the trail pass i think it's 245 okay well i'm very appreciated thank you very much I know we're not doing the right yeah, thing, but like to, we, uh, it sucks because we're just trying to have you fun. You guys are like unlucky. Everyone else wants to have fun, right? You're very unlucky, and we are kind of lucky because we've been getting a lot of complaints about you guys. I don't know. If I'm saying you guys. I'm not sure if it's you guys, yeah. but about ATVs being on the snowmobile trail. Oh, uh, ATVs or like three wheelers? Just curious. Uh, ATVs. So AT yeah, I just saw the other guy or, too. Yeah, ATVs. there was another guy on the road before we turned in here. We saw yeah. him before too. So, so maybe our, there is other. We were people really there. hoping yeah. to catch yeah. the people in the act, it's and I know there's. Not, it's not just you guys it's because we've out. seen tracks of an actual jeep that went like. Yeah. And those destroyed the yeah, actual that's a trail. Uh, like, oh, that's in. super nice. Like, when it comes to the trail. Like, cars are so, wide. so you guys know he explained to you where you need to be, where you're not allowed to be. You guys understand all that? Yeah. So this is the right man. This guy's right the master. He does. This is what he does. No, he has very good knowledge. He told me. I understand. I respect shit. it. So, so if he explained it to you. Go I appreciate with what it. He says, no, okay? I will. Definitely. Thank you guys. Thank you know, you. Sorry for being out here and causing you guys. No, like, and sorry well, you'll know, you'll if know I came future. off. Uh, no, well, you have the I right. You, you have the right to. So much freaking work to do, yeah. and I thought yeah. if I stand here and talk to them, I'm glad he was able to talk to you because it takes me forever. And then you can see one computer die. I know. I've they're, seen they're that. They're terrible. Yeah, like, for sure. The cold doesn't help, the right? Cold doesn't help. But get yourself to a place where you can ride legally and have a blast, man. But carry ID because if anything ever happens. The officers gave them a break, letting a few violations slide. I like to carry mine. <laughs> okay. oh, that was good.